Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Clash of Clans. This is the first in a five-part series, which is going to be me doing Queen Walk against all 50 of the Goblin levels, starting at 1 and going up through 50. Now, I had tried doing this once by um, attacking all 50 in one live shot, and I did pretty well. I got to like level 43 or something. But then I ultimately failed, and I ran out of, of healers, and it just didn't work out. So I thought what I'd do is I'd break this up into five parts. So this episode, part one, is going to be me going after levels one through ten. So I might not even need a, a healer in any of these. So let me get started. So level one in the goblin levels is called payback. So let me show you what I have here. So I have my queen, I have healers, and I have heals and rages and a poison. Now the rules I'm going to impose on myself are I can only use healers from either my clan castle or my barracks and I can also use spells. And like I said I got to level 43 and that was without using any spells um, but I'm gonna let myself use spells because I just could not do get past 43 ish. So level 1 payback one quick shot take out that small cannon and then that is that. So level 2 is called Goblin Forest. Sorry about the quick scrolling, I just want to get through this quickly. Goblin Forest. Okay, this has one archer tower. So I'm just going to try to knock it out quickly. Now my queen is level 12, which is decent, I guess. Um, I mean, obviously you can do this a lot better with a higher level queen, but I should be able to get through most of these pretty easily. Level 3 is called Goblin Outpost. And why am I doing this? I don't know. It's just kind of fun. Now when I get to higher levels, I'm going to have to make more um, I have to make more healers and stuff. But I'm going to see what I can do without using any um, without using any um, healers. See how far I can get. So this is level 3, Goblin Opo Outpost, which is another very easy level with doing Queen Walk. Level 4 is called Rocky Fort. Let me find that one. Rocky Fort. Okay, this has actually three cannons. And I'm going to just start here. Take out a couple of these. Now I will use my um, queen's ability once uh, I get closer to the other cannon. Okay. And this allows me to um, kind of gain some health back on my queen. So that was Rocky Fort level 4. Level 5 is called Goblin Gauntlet. Let me find that. Now I have six healers ready to go, and let me start this one. I don't think I will actually need to use them from one through ten, but I might have to. I'm not sure, so we'll see. I'll take this nice and slow. Yeah, there's some bombs here. Okay, I'm going to use a queen's ability and take out that last building. So that was level five. This is pretty quick and easy. But you'll see, it does get a lot more difficult later on. And you may have seen I did earlier versions of this kind of um, of this kind of thing against the last two um, Sherbert Towers and Pekka's Playhouse, and I have other videos for that. So this is number six called Cannonball Run. I do have my queen, which is good. This has three cannons in it. So these are pretty easy. Once I get to about 10, I will probably need to use some kind of um, some kind of uh, like healers and stuff like that. So let's see what happens here. This should be pretty easy with just the um, with just the archers and the queen. The archers serve as a distraction. The queen comes from behind and takes out the cannons. And there we go. Cannonball run level six, three stars. Number seven is called Two Smoking Barrels. Let's see. Okay, here we go. 
And this has, okay, I see, it has two, two cannons, one's um, pretty powerful. So I'm going to start off by taking out this, the bigger cannon first. I'm going to take it out quickly and use my archers and then basically gang up on the one um, cannon that's left. Let's see what happens here. Okay, that was three stars for two smoking barrels, level seven. Let's see, my queen is fine. Level eight is called Gold Rush. Now, when I do this in the higher levels too, I'm probably going to wind up gemming, um, I'm sorry, boosting the, um, what are they called? Like the barracks and the queen and maybe even the spell factory because I just want to be able to um, get more healers quickly. So I might do that. So let's see, let's check this one out. Level eight gold rush. All right, I'm gonna use her ability in a little bit. Once I take out these two buildings. Actually, I'm gonna do it now. I do wanna make sure she doesn't lose any more health. Hopefully these archers will distract the other cannon. Let's see what happens. Okay. And that was level eight, Gold Rush. No, next is number nine, which is called, I'm not sure how you pronounce this, it's called Maginot Lion. Magino? I'm not sure what that even means. It might actually mean something. Hopefully my queen is back, yes. Okay, so this one has, um, obviously it has uh, one mortar and two cannons. I'm going to start off with the mortar. I don't know if I'm going to need the. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to need to use the um, her ability yet. Okay, she, they get one shot off on her. Once I get closer to the cannons, I will use her ability. Okay, here we go. And that's like I said, more to distract the cannons from attacking her. So that they can at so that she can take out the cannons um, without getting hurt. So here's the last cannon, and I just have two elixir collect storages, and that's it. And that was level nine, and I'm going to end with the next one, which is called Rat Valley, number ten. Let's see where that is. Rat Valley. So this is number ten. This has two cannons in it. No, three cannons, I'm sorry. So I'm going to start with the close one first. And then I am going to wait a little bit before using her ability and go after the last two cannons. So I hope you're enjoying this video so far. It's, like I said, these are the very easy levels that don't require any... Um, oh, she's getting hit by all these bombs now. <laughs> They don't require too much, um, you know, don't need any healers or anything like that. But the later ones, starting with 11, probably I'm going to need to use healers. And there we go, Rat Valley number 10. So I'm going to end this episode here. I hope you liked it. If you did, please don't forget to hit the like button. And please don't forget to comment below and subscribe for more Clash of Clans. Thank you guys for watching.